about as close as you can get to the real thing. Check it out if you can. Around here, we're not dealing with any rain or fog this morning, TJ. So Tuesday's off to a good start. Yeah, clear skies across yeah. the area. I think the clouds will tend to fill in once again as we go through the day. But overall, not a bad day. Let's take a look at what's going on across the area. Here's a look at Newport. Great visibility. Yeah, no fog. And looking at dry skies. Temperature at 54. Wind from the north northeast at 6 miles an hour. And a look at the temperatures elsewhere. 52 over in New Bedford and Taunton. 54 in Providence. Smithfield is at 54 degrees. Our threat tracker for today. Low chance of anything overly impactful. Certainly not a perfect day. We're going to have a lot of clouds kind of working in. Wednesday and Thursday looking uh, fairly quiet. But on Thursday we could be looking at some rain showers arriving. We'll get to that in a second. All Almanac for today. I'm thinking we'll have a high right around 66 degrees. That's a little bit below average. The average this time of year is 72. The low will likely be around 54, and uh, that's pretty much on target. Tropical satellite picture. Something we're watching. This blob of clouds down there in the Western Caribbean. It could potentially form in the Helene over the next couple of days and working its way through the uh, northeastern Gulf of Mexico, perhaps making landfall at least a category to somewhere uh, Florida, Alabama area, somewhere in there uh, later on in the week. So we'll be watching that closely. Meanwhile, what we're looking at is still that ocean storm. It's kind of uh, dispersed with a couple areas of low pressure out there in the ocean. High pressure way up there in Canada, still providing us with uh, a northeasterly wind. It's actually the combination of that high and those areas of low pressure. Uh, we're still looking at that northeasterly and easterly wind. It'll tend to bring in some clouds as we go through the day, but we're starting, we'll start off with sunshine, but notice some clouds coming in off of the ocean. Now tonight, partly to mostly cloudy, I think we're looking at dry skies as we go into your Wednesday, more in the way of clouds will be working in, but I think we're dry during the day. As we get into Thursday, likely starting off with some showers in the area, kind of off and on showers through the day on Thursday. For today, temperatures are going to be topping out about 66, 67 degrees or so with a lot of clouds working and there'll be some sunshine as well. Mainly dry, there could be a sprinkle. Out on the beaches, blend of clouds and some sun, air temperature around 63. That high surf advisory has been canceled, but there's still a moderate risk of rip currents with a pretty good surf of five to seven feet. Out on the bay, winds from the northeast, about 10 knots, waves one to three feet. Visibility not an issue for today. Now for tonight, partly to a times mostly cloudy. Overnight lows getting down to around 54 and then for tomorrow a lot of clouds around, but I think we're dry during the day. Highs around 66 once again. Winds becoming more southeast tomorrow, 5 to 10. Seven day forecast. There are those showers for Thursday, kind of off and on, not a complete washout. 68 degrees on Thursday, a little more humid as well, but look at Friday. Sunshine returning, about 72. Saturday and Sunday looking really nice. Upper 60s to around 70 degrees. Sunny, dry weather all weekend long. Full forecast, you can always find it, including a look at that beach and boating forecast at WPRI.com.